In this video, I will show you how to create an interactive scenario like this, where your learners make decisions, see the consequences, and build real-world communication skills. You can even add text to audio using an AI feature. You handled that with professionalism and empathy. That's the kind of leadership we value. And the best part, you can build it all using iSpring Suite's drag and drop scenario builder right inside PowerPoint. Using the iSpring Suite menu, which has lots of useful e-learning features. Start by adding a blank slide. Then go to the iSpring tab and click role play. Choose new role play and then new scene and we're ready to build. If you need help writing a role play scenario, try entering a prompt like this into an AI tool such as ChatGPT. It can instantly build your scenario with branching paths and dynamic outcomes. How quick and easy is this? Let's get back to building our role play scenario. Choose your character. You can choose from these inbuilt ones or go to add from content library where there are many more to choose from. In this example, I'm going to stick with the inbuilt one. Set their emotion. Choose a background for your character. This is optional, but it can help to set the scene. Then enter the character's speech. For example, here's our opening line. Hi, I wanted to talk about the client report that was due yesterday. I noticed it wasn't submitted on time. Can you walk me through what happened? This is the setup for this scenario. This sets the tone for a realistic and respectful feedback conversation. I'm gonna add a quick message with an instruction for the learner's next step. Then I'll drag this link to create the next scene in this scenario. So this is where the learner will go next. You will then repeat the steps that we did before, changing the character and the speech. This time it's the point of view from the employee who is in trouble for missing a deadline. You then add the replies for the learner to choose from. So what will the manager be selecting as a response? This is where iSpring's drag and drop builder really shines. Just drag each response to a new scene and then repeat the process. This branching is easy to use and follow. You can build as many scenes as you need, each with its own character, emotion and outcome. At the end, add a feedback scene. Maybe a senior manager says, you handle that with professionalism and empathy. That's the kind of leadership we value. Or if the learner had chose a harsher path, that conversation could have been more productive. Feedback should be clear, but also supportive. To add a voiceover, right click on a scene and select voiceover. You have three options. You can record your own voice, import an audio file, or use text-to-speech using an AI voice. This automatically brings the text in. Press play to hear the sound. Hi, I wanted to talk about the client report that was due yesterday. I noticed it wasn't submitted on time. Can you walk me through what happened? You can choose the language and the voice. When complete, click insert. When you're done adding the audio, click close voiceover mode. Test your scenario at any point by clicking preview. Here you can play out the scenario. Then click save and return to course and it drops right into your PowerPoint. These are text boxes that you can edit or delete. You can resize and move the role play scenario. You can preview your scenario from here too. Want to try this for yourself? Download a free trial of iSpring Suite. The link is in the description below. And let me know in the comments what kind of scenario you would build. Say